Now your hair. Is there a meaning behind your hair? <laughs> no, nah, this is I grew up. Like, really, these they grew up with me when I grew. Like I, I grew up, I had these. I don't know. I could say about two, three, four years. But I mean, cutting them and ends been breaking up and cut. So really, just they just grow with me. They don't got no meaning to it. It's my image, really. It's my look. But how long is the length? Not inches, but how how much time is the hair growth we see today? You said three or four. I didn't mean since you were three or four years old. No, or like three, three or four, or four years. years. Oh, so this is three to four years of growth. Yeah, but three or four years of growth, like breaking off and cutting them. And You've been keeping them at this length? Yeah, at this length. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now, um, when it comes to locks, what's your biggest pet peeve with them? What bothers you the most about them, if anything? They irritate. Like, they really just, like, you might think something crawling on you. It's your dress. You might, like... Or you trying to eat some food, your dress in your face, so you can't and it get all in the way of your food. Like then you get you get you get up in the morning. You know what I'm saying? One dread might be up. You know you gotta just fix yourself. You know how you gotta get your posture right. Just but overall, it's my look. I, I fuck with. <laughs> what about people pulling on them? Pulling on them? Nah, I don't respect that. Really, just female playing my hair. Other than that, no. Nah. I ain't going for that. Like if you're walking in the club and a female just pulls on it as you're know. walking? Not if, you, if I don't know you. I really don't even like that in the first place. Like, females not pull on my hand. I just be like... I but you know how people are. They're high. They're drinking. Yeah. <laughs> they just see you walking by. They might, you know, as a flirting thing, they might just reach, reach out and touch you, you know? Yeah. But nah, I ain't going for so that. So do you get upset when that happens? Yeah, of course. Of course, I don't like that. <laughs> Now, one bit. now, what is your opinion, and this is something that I've been seeing recently that I haven't seen before, but I've been seeing men uh, wearing fake locks, having fake braids. Uh, what is your opinion of that? Uh, look, I don't judge no man, but on that note, me, I, I, I ain't going. And when my partner do something like that, I ain't going. Like, that's, mm, no. Just grow. Why don't you just let them grow? Why, why would you put some? That's some females put in their hair. Weave, so why, why would you put that in your hair? Just, just leave it up to them. You a man. At the end of the day, let them grow. And if it ain't for you, find something that's for you. Better cut your hair, low cut, three sixties or something. You know how it go. Now, what about coloring the locks or the uh -huh. braids? What is your opinion of that? Because a lot of guys have been doing like. The bright colors too, like bright blues, pinks, reds, purples, <laughs> all kinds of stuff. Um, What's your opinion of that? Uh, um, blonde, the blonde ones too. I, ain't, I can't, I can't really say nothing about that. Cause I had blonde dread before, so. Oh, you I, did. Yeah, but like the 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 greens and the blues and all that. I don't know. Like if that's their style. That's their style. You feel me? Cause some people got that, and they real street. You know what I'm saying? They really out here doing what they supposed to do, but they got red dreads or they got green dreads or whatever so it's like i can't really i ain't gonna judge no man for that you feel me what's the reaction you get when people see your locks oh i'm a hoodlum oh I, well <laughs> i'm a hoodlum just well for the female they like you but for for like other people either i'm a hoodlum or he got to be doing something else ain't productive besides you know what i'm saying which mean could be anything else Robbing or something like that, and really, nah, I just get money. So you felt discrimination, stereotyping, yep, and profiling? Yep, most definitely. What's the worst experience you've encountered dealing with that? Anything <laughs> that's stuck out? <laughs> with that county police. <laughs> I've heard, of, I've, I've heard, you know, doing interviews with several guys with locks. I've heard the police dealing with the police, police dealing with them. It's <laughs> an issue. Yeah, it really is an issue, but... I just try to duck, duck and dodge. It's a jungle out here, so I just duck and dodge, you know? We wolves and they sheep, so you gotta duck and dodge. But nothing crazy specifically has happened, just you felt that, that no, those no, feelings no. with the it police. It was crazy. Guns to my face and all, it was crazy. Because of your hair? No, nah, not because of my hair, but I knew what it, what, what it was after they got me out, you know what I'm saying? Put me in, cause like, yeah, I know you did this. That's what they telling me. Feel me? Oh, they like, uh, who the first nigga going to jail? The nigga with the fucked up dread. They talk about me. I'm like, uh. you know, and I'm just looking like, okay, cool. You know, I don't say nothing. Leave that up to the lawyer. 
So the police has pulled guns on you before? Oh yeah, of course. And I don't, I don't. It's nothing I want to speak about. It's nothing for you know. what I'm saying jail ain't cool for no, for no man, you know. But it's like it happens real life, and you know what I'm saying. I seen it, and I avoid that now. You feel me? Beat the case. I'm, I'm on some other. You know what I'm saying? Mm. Whole type of other. If in that county, <laughs> with the Migos caught enough, that's 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 what. That's you know, a very what? scary thing mm -hmm. to have a gun pulled on you. Yeah. Pointed at you. Yeah. That, the police and the streets, it, it could be anything. Somebody trying to take something from you, yeah. Mm. It's, all a, it's all about what you're going to do and how you think. Because it flat before your eyes when it really happens. It should be crazy.